just too strong from CC Aleko. Currently averaging a double-double thus far is Aleko. She is the cornerstone of this team for Canisius. And there's a cornerstone for Illinois, Genesis Bryant. Rush their offense. They know Illinois can get out in transition and be very effective with it. We've already seen it from the Illini, and the Golden Grays Griffins are just going to look to try and play their game, and there it is right there, another three-pointer. Shauna Green, Illinois teams that, let's just say, weren't quite as competitive as they have been in this last year or so. Long attempt there, and that one goes. Alexa doesn't bite, back to Bryant. Peebles sending it into Hobby, and Hobby takes the dribble step and shoot, and just too strong. McKenzie quickly back up the floor. And we're seeing the efforts of Kanisha's trying to get the ball to Aleko over and over. Dolan, fantastic there. Once more, three points. Gretchen Dolan already has five. I mean, she's playing against a New York team here, so maybe there's a little extra motivation for Gretchen Dolan in this one. Look at that from Adalia McKenzie getting her hands out. Can she find the finish? Off the glass, gets the roll. But we'll see if McCarter Hook can see some fluid motion and continue her progress off that injury. Here's Genesis Bryant. She'll take the three and connect. Genesis, Genesis Bryant, Bryant is finding three. rhythm here. That's her second three-pointer of the day. Looking thrash. Aleko trying to get free off of Bostic. Amalia is going to take it. Aleko gets it. And finally, it took nearly eight minutes of game time. Here's McKenzie finding Bostic inside. And Bostic just had the advantage. Big time mismatch on the inside. Here's Aleko working her way inside. And Lamora is going to take the three, and that one falls. So it was working well early in the first quarter, the three ball. And already played nine minutes, which outpaces her Notre Dame play time already. She got into foul trouble early and was unable to be a factor. Genesis Bryant gets another Illinois steal. Can she get the finish? It's that scooping layup that she is so good at. That super stuff from Ira you're talking about? Some, some Caitlin Clark. Bostic, yet another steal. The turnovers keep piling on, and McKenzie punishes the Griffs. Timeout taken by Coach. Here's Cook now, finding Hobby inside. Looking to work around Lamora. Shot is blocked, and turnover, Illinois having to defend quickly. Aleko gets into the paint with ease, and she lays it in. They have plans to play into the midweeks of March. So to get a player like Camille Hobby is massive for Shauna Green. Gianna Hernandez, bold and good effort on her part. She gets the foul called against her. She's gotten much more comfortable in this game than she was against Notre Dame. And here's the explosion from Cook. Does not get the finish, just too strong. But it's a wrestled away Kendall rebound Bostic. for Kendall Bostic. Haven't seen the likes of Shea Bolin all that much today. Jada Peebles hasn't seen action in some time as well. Bryant trying to work her way in once more. There's that scooping layup. If confidence were a currency, she's going to find Brooklyn Thrash, who's going to try another three. That one just too strong. Bryant collects, looking for Bostic on the quarterback's pass. Can she get the finish? Bostic does. 30-point game here. Look, Brooklyn Thrash. It's good ball movement, and... Thrash is going to make the run to the basket and get the finish. Nice set possession there oh, for the nice. Griffs. Razi trying to get Cook off of her defensively. Opens up Athena Lexa for the three. That one's good. That was well worked there by the Griffs. Points here for Canisius. Athena Lexa trying to capitalize. Bolin's going to get the rebound. There's five seconds left here. Can Illinois get something up? Dolan finds Hobby. Hobby takes her time Pretty. and gets the easy finish to restore a 30. Defending Grace Heaps. Heap's going to work her way around. Three seconds, two seconds. Rozzy has to heave it, but it goes. And there's a three ball for Canisius. All bench players in now for the hosts. Aleko will send it to Mary Koppel, who gets the three to fall at the buzzer. Well, the scoreline may tell one story, but Mary Koppel is going to slow things down here. The theme today for Coach Nasebe was trying to slow things down as much as possible. Dolan crumbles under the physicality of CC Aleko that time. As Bree Razi may be leading the last Canisius possession of the day. Lexa's going to shoot from three off the glass. I don't think the bank is open on Sunday. Ideal interaction for head coach Shauna Green and her alma mater in this game. Peebles will work inside. And 90 points for Illinois. One last quick shot here. Mary Koppel tries to heave it up there. And Alexa gets the rebound, but it does not <laughs> fall. 90-58 is the final score here at State Farm Center.